My name is Philip Santos. I'm the owner of JS Masonry Incorporated. Uh, it's a bricklaying, stonework, and uh, cinder block company. We do the majority of uh, bricklaying for a specific building. I was looking online for trackers to use. At first, I had purchased an air tag, and the air tag never showed the exact location of where my trailer was. So then I researched where safe uh, online. Purchase where safe, and anytime I check on my phone's app, I know exactly where my trailer is. I purchased the mag tracker so that way, then it's a magnetic hookup, so that way, I uh, just have to charge it once every two weeks. Uh, you do need to get a notification when the battery's starting to die. So, approximately around five o'clock in the morning on the 20th of June, I got a message on my phone that the cargo trailer was moving. So I got up, went and checked the location of the trailer and it was moving towards a certain location, phoned the police. And then by the time I got to where the location of the trailer was, the police were already there and the trailer was left at the side of the, at a parking uh, garage. And I was able to locate my tracker or my trailer because of the tracker and its notifications within an hour. Uh, the theft of the trailer kind of delayed things for a couple of weeks. Uh, while it was being repaired, but thankfully that I was able to recover the trailer so quickly because I was able to get the equipment out of it and not be delayed even further than two weeks. Um, and also to saving thousands of dollars of having to purchase another trailer. Uh, I'm actually thinking of purchasing a couple more GPS tractors for my heavy machine equipment that I have, a skid steer and a forklift. Uh, so that way then I can make sure that nobody tries to steal that.